welcome to the David Robertson Show, where I'm your host, David Robertson. Today, our segment is concerning the Donald Trump Section 8 proposed cutbacks. As you well know, it'll all be implemented, I believe, October 1st throughout the nation. Well, it is what it is. And contrary to uh, popular belief, uh, it's not going to devastate, especially you ladies, because that's who it's meant for, young ladies. No, this isn't the end, but instead the beginning. You ladies have survived far more devastation than this. But to know something, there are those who's in the mindset that uh, ladies and men, and, and particularly ladies, uh, are, are deadbeats, are, 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 are lazy. You're talking about the premier woman in the United States. You're speaking of a woman who should be considered as a virtuous woman. That's correct. Righteous. It's easy to bash and knock down. Why don't you try to lift up? Well, at any rate, ladies, better days are yet to come. Believe you me, we all are in this together. And I, for one, adore and respect you. As far as I'm concerned, you are the wind beneath my wings. In addition, it said, I shall not walk in front of you. You shall not walk behind me, but on the side of me as it was meant to be. For without you, there's no me. Ladies, worry not. Not at all, not to the least. Because you ladies are from a lineage of individuals who have the ability to take something and make, I stand correct, to take nothing. Because that's the intention of the Trump administration. Let me reiterate, have the ability to take nothing and create something. You are not only the backbone, but in addition, a shared forefront. I adore you all. And this isn't going for any particular race, creed, or ethnicity. This is for all of the female gender. I mean, it's far beyond just birthing us, nourishing us, rearing us. That is correct, rear not raise. You raise cattle. You rear children. And you ladies do a fine job. Second to none. Well, at any rate, this is the answer to the proposed Donald Trump cutback. In fact, and I'm not being facetious, it's relatively simple. He intends to take away what you and I will do is to give. He intends to erase. Ladies, you and I intend to replace. I tell you, ladies, the best has yet to come. i like to share a phrase with you, beautiful women. Give no thought to the past, nor to yesterday. But see, we're going to make a new way. Behold, for it shall raise up. Now is the time. For faith is the substance of things hoped on and the evidence for things unseen. And ladies, entrepreneurism is the way to go. Home-based business is not just a punchline at a party, but it's a reality. And these are the things that were 
I believe, intentionally kept from us. The ability to own your own business. You have to start somewhere. You ladies have the perseverance like I've never seen before. Each day I see. Don't you worry about it, ladies. We're going to work together. We're going to succeed. And ladies, irregardless of what Mr. Trump or anyone perceive of you, keep in mind it is not your reality. No, this isn't the end, but the beginning. The plan will not fail. Neither shall we fail the plan. And the plan is a simple one, is to become self-sufficient. And we're going to do that, ladies. Fret not, cry not. We shall succeed. We're doing this to lit together, ladies. And gentlemen, I don't want to be accused of being a male chauvinist pig or any peripheral treatment. But I will stand and say this. Be sure to stay tuned to my channel, the David Robertson channel. Yes, we're offering cash and prizes, but for more than just simply that. From this point on, I and my producers are going to do a series of self-help instructional videos. We're going to get through this, ladies. This is David Robertson signing off, and God bless you all.